Hi, my name is Jake Ramirez and I'm a partner development rep on the AWS Global Startup Team. I would like to walk you through the foundational technical review process, also known as the FTR. The AWS FTR helps startups ensure their solution is built based on AWS well-architected best practices and security standards. This self-service review helps AWS partners identify and remediate risks in their software or solution offerings to protect the partner and in customer workloads on AWS. It typically takes around four to six weeks or 15 hours to submit an FTR. This depends on how the solution is built and volume of findings. Once your solution is FTR approved, it will be valid for two years and is conducted at no cost. It is recommended to submit an FTR for each product, but require one FTR to achieve the validated stage within the software path. The FTR is a prerequisite for all co-selling and co-marketing activities within the AWS Partner Network. To start your FTR, you will need to access AWS Partner Central. If you're not the Alliance Lead, you will need to be granted permission. Once you have Partner Central open, hover over Build and click on Offerings, then click on Create. Go through each section and ensure that each required field is filled out. You will not be able to proceed to the next section without first filling out all of the prior section's required fields. Once you get to the validation section, you will see a hyperlink to AWS Foundational Technical Review Guide. This will walk you through the entire FTR process and provide additional information as to what is required to submit. The first step in this process is to define your offering type. Two options are supported, SaaS and self-hosted. The first option is partner-hosted or SaaS. This means critical components run within the partner's AWS account. The second option is self-hosted or bring your own license. This means the solution components are deployed in the customer's AWS environment. In order for the request button to appear, you must first enroll to the software path and pay the APN fee, which you will be reimbursed with AWS credits once your invoice is paid. It typically takes three to five days for your FTR to be assigned to a partner solutions architect. The PSA will then review your FTR and report back your critical findings. If there are any areas of remediation, the PSA will work with you and your team to enable those remediations. Your organization will have six months to make those remediations before having to resubmit the full FTR again. You will be required to renew your FTR every two years or if there are any major changes to the back end before those two years. An approved FTR will also provide listing for your software in the AWS Partner Solution Finder, allowing customers to easily find and contact you. For more information, visit the AWS Global Startup Program website or email the team.